my five top tips for swimming. Uh, first off, race your own race. Um, I, sometimes I even have difficulties doing this, but it's really important to uh, focus on what you're doing and not worry about what everyone else around you is doing. Um, I find that's really important. Um, it makes me really focus on my own race and, and not worry about what others are doing, especially, you know, some people go out really hard and can't come back at, at the end of the race, so make sure you pace yourself. When it comes to breathing and swimming, I like to stick to a pattern, so make sure you get into a good rhythm with your breathing, uh, something that's comfortable for you. So sometimes, depending on the distance, I might breathe twos, but I'll always breathe to my right side. Um, or in a 100 metre race, I'll breathe fours. Um, but it all depends on the individual and what's more comfortable for you. With freestyle technique, it's really important to have a really high elbow in the water, so you're getting a full catch with not just your hand, but your entire forearm. Uh, I think a lot, of, a lot of people tend to drop their elbow and lose their catch. They're only sort of pulling down with their hand. So it's really important to make sure you have a really high elbow so you're getting that full catch in your swim stroke. When it comes to nutrition, what I would normally eat on the morning of a race would probably be poached eggs on toast or uh, an egg white omelette. Um, obviously high in protein, uh, lean, healthy, uh, low sugar content, low fat content, high, yeah, just high in protein, uh, good energy. Uh, when it comes to kilometres in the pool in, the, in a week, um, I'll tend to stick to about 50 or less kilometres. Uh, a lot of swimmers might do a lot more than that, but it's uh, really important that you're doing uh, kilometres that you're going to be doing them properly. Uh, so technique and holding good water and uh, working on all the little skills, um, not overdoing it so you're getting shoulder injuries or anything like that. So uh, it's really important to be um, not overdoing it. 